Welcome back to another episode of the Jabari Show. I am one of your hosts, Jabari. My guest, well, sorry, my co-host is um, nowhere to be found. Um, we are somewhere, somewhat back at, you know, a decent setup. I hope you have been liking the lighting and the effort that we've been putting into it. We've been trying a lot harder this year. That was the goal. Um, thank you for watching, listening, and subscribing. Uh, thank you for Brunton Studio for allowing us to use their space as well. Um, what are you doing? Everything is recording, right? I think so. Um, yeah. I believe that's everything that I have to say for oh. now. Oh, everything hates. No, no, everything doesn't hate. I just wanted to say that. All right. Hi, guys. Welcome back to another episode of the Joe. Oh, wait. Did I, did I just. <laughs> I just <laughs> you already. Um, I just did that. Okay. I did what you did to me. <laughs> um, I'm leaving that in there. I was just going to send a video saying okay. that I'm recording. Okay, okay. I mean, you could. I don't know what you had to. Um, I don't know what you had to to say. I don't have anything to say. This you said something was interesting. When? Dude, I don't know, earlier. When I had my head down here. Five minutes ago, ten minutes ago. When I had my head down here, I'd be on it. I genuinely was falling asleep. Nope, the keys are here. Oh. Well, That's okay. I think it's fine. Like, I was genuinely falling asleep. I have not taken my midday nap. It's a thing. Um... I I I wake up late, so it's fine. <laughs> yeah, no, it's I've been going since about seven this morning. Why do we never have headphones? This is so nice. Uh, yeah. I think we need to get a splitter though. No, you could plug in there. I can plug in. I don't have two. a quarter. No, but you could have two. Oh, yeah, but we don't have a quarter. Another quarter. Sorry, it's just again a quarter. What's a quarter as opposed to? Yeah, I got you. A splitter. Um, I mean, we probably could get another, like, a splitter for that one. For yeah. When we have a guest, we could have mm-hmm. three headphones, and then we need to buy headphones. We need to work on getting guests. I didn't, um, I didn't pay for these. I can't remember the price of these. These mm-hmm. are expensive, though. I know that. To ship them. Yeah. Because, um. All right, yeah, I remember you telling me. Tyrone bought them for me, and he was like, three hundred dollars US <laughs> to ship it and I was like, excuse? Yeah, no. He's like, yeah, I was like, it costs fifty dollars. And when he asked for it as a gift because it was cheap, it's like, you know, you don't really have to think about it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that was a very expensive um Yeah, ship man. Yeah, this needs to last. Yeah. No. It's been lasting. Um yeah, I, I, I treat this like a dog. <laughs> <laughs> I like dogs by the way, but um Mm-hmm. I meant it, and like I just would. That's what I would do. Yeah. There's a big difference. You're literally in my ear. When I took it off, and you just said yes, I was like, I, I don't, I don't know what you just said. Oh, okay, okay. There's literally like, yeah, in my ear. Yeah. And also, so the fact that I'm talking and I'm hearing myself. Yeah. Immediately, is cre- technology is wild now when you think about it. Also, in what way? Well, I'm just thinking about this audio in the sense of I'm saying it and I don't even have to think about, like, you know, like, sometimes you listen to something or maybe it's, like, so delayed. At least I used to listen to things, like, a while ago, like, when I was really small. Yeah. And I would, like, talk into a mic and I'd wait for it to come back in my ear. Okay. And the delay would be so much to where, like, when I talk, oh yeah, it messes me up. Oh, okay. But okay. this is, like, yeah, that's I foot and foot behind you. Yeah. Yeah. Literally right there. Yeah. So I don't have to like think I'm about wor- yeah, I don't have to think about anything. I just do my thing. Like hello. And it hello. Works. <laughs> yeah. Literally I'm watching you talk. Yeah. And as you say it, I'm hearing <laughs> it and I'm like, I cannot decipher. The delay. The delay. Yeah. Because yeah. it's so quick. Mm-hmm. It literally goes through there, does whatever it has to do in there, comes it, to the computer, does whatever it has to do there, then comes back. 
yeah to the it changes it from a digital uh, analog to a digital signal and then back into a that's it's a DAC. That's my old man. Um, that's my old man <laughs> moment. <laughs> yeah. Um, other than that. Yeah, well, that's the good thing about the DAC. What did you say? We have uh, what? A who? A DAC. The good thing about the DAC. Yeah, I'm gonna pretend like I know what that is. A digital to analog converter. Yeah. Yeah. I was talking to somebody. Uh-huh. I know you said we have to get more guests. Yeah. On. Yeah. The show. Mm-hmm. Um. We'll work on it. Yeah. Um, if you subscribe, if you like and share and subscribe to us, we promise that we will have, uh, we promise that we will increase the production, the guests, because we really supposed to have guests here like almost every other week. Yeah. Um, it's really not just supposed to be out about us. Um, but I think it's cool that y'all get to know a little bit about us and then we could get into the guests yeah. from there. I've been watching like a local podcast. I saw like, I think they do like once a month. Once a month? Um, a post, but they always have a guest. Oh, okay. That which is sense. really good. Yeah. So I just watched one with Major Penny. That was like a good two hour listen. <laughs> I sent you it. No. Okay. You, okay. I, I'll send it to you. Um, <laughs> But that was a good I listen. I keep feeling like that is the recording note, although I know it's a bit different. The tone is a bit different. What the recording? The tone, the your notification. Oh, you tone. mean like when the thing talks it and it's like using it as a mic? No, your notification tone. I keep still thinking it is the record start, like you know the record start tone. It doesn't sound like I that. I know it's a bit different, but it it's close. Mm, I don't know. I. I decide for that it's as like a the, message. It's like, okay, it's the same, I guess, chord structure, but different note. So okay. instead of, as it's not as deep as, oh. it's like slightly deeper. Okay. But my brain just thinks, who's talking our recording? Oh, right, right, right. right. What was I going to say? Major pen. Production. Yeah. Guess. Better guess. Yeah. I want to say more vibes, but um, we'll vibes see what it. we could do on that. <laughs> I think not holding any mics is 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 fun. Mm-hmm. Um, it's new. Yeah, it's. it's I just cool. is one of those things where one thing I do appreciate about it is like you can you go just through. Need to keep your head right here. Yeah, <laughs> not only that, but like if you go through all the episodes of the podcast, you can see it goes from not no um, <laughs> no visuals, then you yeah. finally get a visual, and then you know you can see a. Uh, quite literally, you could scroll through and see an uh, increase in the um, production yeah. quality. Yeah. I, I dig that. While it, a lot of places just address start off grand. Yeah. All the reach there. At least nobody can say, well. Um, yeah, for the people who started from the ground up. Yeah. What, yeah. Did, what do you know about that? <laughs> yeah, yeah. What do you know about that? Um, <laughs> because I was talking to Jay. And mm-hmm. I was telling him. Oh, that man no. never is one to me, eh? Huh? He never is one to me. He asked me something. Uh huh. He literally, this man ain't talked to me in like a month, <laughs> right? Mm-hmm. He's like, hey, send me your, um, your CRM now. And I was like, okay. Mm-hmm. I sent it to him the same night, and then he never responds to me. <laughs> and I just hear like, no, well, this did, one you, I, this one did I, it work? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> you getting through? Like, let me know, like, did I send everything <laughs> properly? I, I just did busy, dog. No, I know, but I just. Yeah, I understand. I feel used. <laughs> You know, it's just like, hey, that's what I want. You get it and you're gone. That's how that's how we treat me. <laughs> no, well, I saw him in person. Oh. And he was like, oh, yeah, message a warrior. I wanted to get some information. I was like, okay. <laughs> and then I, and then he had asked me about where we shot the, um, the images with ocean. Mm, I just told him. In the ocean. Um... um yeah, I told him it's Vancouver. Yeah, I, I told him. I told him I don't know where it is. Talk to Jabari. Yeah, yeah. I I drove, but just I just followed. Know, he just followed. I don't me. know how to reach there if you really. Yeah, you know, I directed him to the back of my head. Couldn't find back that place. Oh, I know near the gas station. Mm-hmm. Okay, I know once I make that right by the gas station, if I'm coming down for the thingy, mm-hmm. I will see the, the streets. With the palm trees. The palm trees, and yeah. I know to turn on in that road, but I don't know. Yeah. That's about it. Um, um, 
What was I going to say? You, you know, um, wait, so I was telling him that, oh, no, the podcast had a different name. And he's like, oh, I only know it as Jabari and Jabari. I was like, don't worry. It's fine. I mean, we just dropped one name. No, we was from the ground up first. Oh, but I thought you mean like oh, no, the Jabari no. show. Yeah, no, I was telling him that it had a different name. And then he was like, oh, I didn't know that. I thought it was just the Jabari show all the time. I was like, oh, no. I was like, oh, no. It's no, a no, we had to go through a whole struggle. Yeah. It's a whole too much to say. Yeah. Um, so we had to. How has this week been for you? What's today? Sunday? Yeah. Uh, what did I do this week? I don't think we have much going on right now. Yeah. We had a couple of things going on. But, um. Hmm. My calendar. Yes, I have a fish brain. I am. <laughs> Hold on. Why does this look so funny? Um, there was just a bunch of bookends, really. Mm-hmm. Um, I, I really have just been home a lot this week. Yeah. And I need to edit some stuff. I want to... G- I have, like, three shoots there to edit that I need to get done today so I could start tomorrow fresh because I have a shoot tomorrow. Okay. Um, super secret project. And, Yeah. Okay. This is a personal project or? Uh, kind of, yes. Kind of. I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> okay. Um, I was asked to shoot something um, and I like the project, so I'm, I'm doing it and hoping that it pays off in the future. They usually do. So, yeah. But I have to carry some stuff. I have to do like a a list of things that I need to get for that. Okay, okay. But uh, yeah, that's about it. I could you say something for me? Uh, what do you want me to say? Just anything. I just anything. need to see. I could see. say anything that you need me to say. I felt like for me that's because uh, low key like a struggle week. Like I. Like mental week. It was just a mentally trying week where I my brain is like, I need to get out of the house and do something. But then the reality is like get I out and not do to what? Them. Go, go and do what? Right. I have nothing to go and do. Oh. Um things are like really slow. Right now, so it's just yeah, everything is slow. Yeah, and everybody is convinced that I am working all the time, and I'm <laughs> like, bro, I've literally just been home. Yeah, editing a couple of things here and there, and I'm just like mentally yeah. drained for the rest of the day. Yeah, and I never do anything else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, I have been always a person to just be, I'm doing something, I'm do going, 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 but now it's a period of just. Real silence. Yeah, nothing is happening. Yeah, nothing happening, and my brain don't know what to do with that. Yeah, and it feels like it kind of attacking itself because it's like. I mean, I have a, I have a little fear of well, not a fear, but mm-hmm. you know, I, I kind of hope in that this period of nothingness, I'm just gonna get one well, set yeah. of projects, and it's going to take over so much of my time, and I'm like, okay, yeah, so it's a good thing I have that I have that break of nothing. Yeah, that's exactly where I'm at. Where I'm like. Enjoy the quiet moments because when things start to ramp back up, you'll be wishing that you were back in those quiet moments yeah. and thinking, why did I waste my time just doing nothing? I yeah. should have just, you know, embraced the nothing. And, um, but I'm not going to lie. It has not been like a bed of roses. It's just. No, it's really, it's really just, mentally draining yeah, just to, to do nothing. Be, yes. It, no, doing nothing takes a lot. This is not it. Yeah. I don't know how y'all do it. Yeah. But I need stimulation. Something to be going on. Something, yeah. yeah. Um, I'm like, do I start back playing games? Like, I don't know. Like, yeah. No, dude. What do I do to pass my time? Yo, my weekly screen time is crazy. Oh, my, well, my phone? No, I got like, mine today, Sunday. No, like, dude. Monday, I spent 15 hours on YouTube. Dog. 
okay, I, I, I need to check it on the computer because that's really where I spend most of my time. But on my... F- I'll check it one time. Dog, that is madness. How? How? Like, each day I'm clocking, like, seven, eight hours on YouTube outside of Monday. My total, I looked at it this morning, and I was seeing, like, 58 hours on YouTube. That's... That's not good. <laughs> I'm like, bro, go touch some grass. Like, go outside. Shake somebody's hand, you know? Go see the wheel. Go wake out, something. But I, it's not uh, readily available to me to just, you know, go and do. I live in far. Everybody else live in far. Um, and or don't live in a country. And or weekend, so you know. My daily usage. Mm-hmm. I hear what you're saying. I was just um, checking it. No, I see. You probably found what you. I was really was struggling to find it because it was giving me a daily usage. Oh, not the weekly. But I, I was trying to figure out to switch it to weekly. I was like, okay. Um, my average is like f- at fourteen hours. <laughs> pretty. Mine is seven hours and thirty six minutes. Mm-hmm. And that is apparently across all my devices. Yeah. So that's the phones and the laptop. So I don't think that's that bad considering that I work from my laptop. Oh yeah, no, I literally I spent thirty four hours in Arc. But I could just also that be like you, things playing in the background too. Yeah. I spent two hours on Photoshop, which I feel like I literally didn't even open up Photoshop for the week. <laughs> I spent two hours on Capture One, which is crazy considering that. What did I even do that needed two hours of work in Capture One? It may have just been on. Yeah. Um. So I can I think I trust more the screen time of overall everything because I would just leave an app open. Okay. Actually, no. I never use my iPad. My iPad. This has when the app is like when you click into it and yeah. you're using it because i'm seeing the messages i spent like uh, uh almost an hour okay in messages app so mm. yeah yeah because no. i know i would click into that and just like gonna leave my, it open because i'll be two screens my message and apps are one some of the lowest um so like whatsapp and imessage is some of the lowest like you get like 17 minutes so some stupid like that no, nah, my WhatsApp is two hours. Oh, dang. Yeah, yeah. That's I, like most people just use WhatsApp, so it's just like I, I have it there. No, but look I leave it, it like, on. Do you think like my WhatsApp would clock like an hour for the day? It's like if my uncle calls me from the States to check in on me. Yeah. Other than that, 30 minutes, 17 minutes, 20 minutes for the whole day. Yeah, I mean, I don't need to spend long in there. No, but I'd also, it's, I guess it depends on how many people are messaging you. Yeah. But I like, uh, but something like my iPad, I never use this thing. I can show you. Look, my weekly average. <laughs> so then you don't need the iPad then. I, I th- I'm a, I'm gonna start back using it because um, I went back out to put some knowledge in my brain. Oh, so you're gonna make it a really expensive Kindle. A really expensive notebook. Sure. Okay. Yeah. Um. Hmm. But yeah, I I don't know. It's just I'm trying to get over this hurdle and try to I want to lean back into being creative because I have not touched my camera to intentionally take a picture in months. Oh, and that camera needs to be put to work. Yes, it needs to. Uh, like. When I first got it, I think that initial spark of, oh, yeah, new camera. Let's do this thing. Every month I had at least one shoot, so it was kind of paying for itself. No, yeah. it's not. Mm. There's a very expensive people we've had this current yeah. moment. It has seen more time recording this podcast than anything else. Like, quite literally, if it wasn't for this podcast. I mean, I think it would, that's natural, though, right? What? Like, even if I was shooting a lot, I feel feel like because of the podcast yeah if it were my camera and all yeah it would pick up more hours just because of the uh, shoot might be like what hour 
so much long. No, but in terms of like actual usage, is oh, what okay. I mean. It's like if it weren't for the podcast, it yeah. would be getting absolutely no usage. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Which I want to get out of, but I just, I don't know. I really want to lean into the travel content. But oh, uh, travel? Yeah, lean into the travel content. You travel in the country? Yeah, that's the next you thing. You can review places, be like, hey, I want to make yeah, I want this to video. Highlight. So that's Let the me thing. stay at your place for two nights. I don't know about all of that. <laughs> but I do want to highlight some of the things in Trinidad because I see people going places and I'm like, what is this? Huh? huh? These, places, these places exist in this country. Uh, yeah, yeah, they always go down in the bush, north coast, <laughs> and other places. Yeah, no, because like uh, my gypsum man, he was cool in all that place, right? And I was like, he was like, you ever want to buy this lighthouse? I was like, you nah, I just know the one in town. It, right, <laughs> no, right, so he was talking about something. Antoko? Song. Yeah, it had one in the mansion, apparently. Mansion, I don't know. Mansion, I don't know. I Miaro area, yeah. like going down there. Mm-hmm. And I was like, that one down there. <laughs> How far? I don't know. I didn't go into asking many questions, but I was just kind of like, oh, I didn't know that was a thing. I should probably go and take what a drive down there. We're supposed to go to Toko at some point. Mm-hmm. My girl has never been. Oh, that would be interesting. So I... That'd be a fun trip. We were trying to figure out how to get him to go down to Toko. <laughs> that um, would be a fun trip. There's not really a car, so... Yeah, I get that. Yeah, and it's a little long drive. It, it's a bit of a long drive. So that was my plan. Uh huh. Um, not sure how it's gonna happen. Yeah. So, but I also try and I've been watching. I wonder if Michael listens to this boy. Sometimes. I was gonna say something. I wanna do something, but I don't know if he listens to it. He so does. I can't. Okay. Well but I don't know. But like, it's one of those things where mind. he doesn't listen to it all the time. But when he does sit down to listen to it, he would listen to them in a bunch. From ah, what he's told me. Okay. He's like, oh, I was not going to sit down and listen to the podcast. I was like, sit down and listen. I always cringe at it a bit. All right. Well, then. I will save it until after. Yeah, so I don't know when he would actually sit down and listen to it. I'll save it until after. <laughs> okay. But I, c- I can tell you after, though. Because okay, okay, it, okay. it's funny. I thought about it. Yeah. In me messaging y'all. Oh. Yeah, because I, I was actually <laughs> going to. So when I told you I couldn't make, mommy had to. Well, I told you mommy was going out in the afternoon. Yesterday. Right? Right. Then when mommy was and they was getting ready, he messaged me. He's like, Oh I going up Santa Cruz to look at a place. You wanna come? I was like I was just gonna be home, but sure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um so I ended up going out to Santa Cruz with him and Porsche. Um and that was cool. That was cool. A place to buy? Uh, more he- him. I don't know if he's gonna buy or oh. I don't know. Okay. I, you know. I don't know. I I can tell if it's like I'm gonna move out. Who me? No him. him. Oh, I. I As in, I'm gonna move out. I'm gonna look at a place. If it's like oh, I look into no, something. No, it was also. Land now. I I mean I had told them about the place and I told them that I was looking at it, but I don't know. Like my brain kind of just. And my brain don't know how to decide for things at this current mm. moment. Like, I don't know. I feel like I'm not thinking on a straight line. And I don't know how to get out of that. That looks like tiredness. No, no, no. I know, wake up. I just had a nap. I nap so much when I'm here. Literally. <laughs> Once you touch our couch, it's oh, upstairs. Game oh, yeah, over. I know. I know, I know. You, it happened to you? Yes. Bro, I, I, I told David this. I had a shiver. I told David this. I said, I could never get no, any cream, work done. You can right? Upstairs? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, no. I'm I like, I sit down on it, planning to do work. I open up that laptop. That something is about it. the AC is just hit you. Because even mommy, mommy, when last time mommy was here, something about the AC is just hit you. Just perfectly. Yeah, because the roof hot, 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 and then the AC kind of yeah. mixes with it so it's not like super cold the but AC's not like blowing on you it just blows yeah. just you know just to like circulate the air in the room and you're like ways wait, wait. this like, is like oh, this cost kinda the perfect squidgy. temperature you see like how this is like the fan right above us this is a little yeah. too cold for me I can, but yeah, that I one is just drop. like 
No, but I mean like yeah, no, it does. I need like something to cover up with. Yeah. You know, that one is like, wait, I can sleep right now. Yeah. Who like, care? And then it's like the couch is just like the perfect amount yeah. of softness. It's just it's not too hard. It's yeah, not too no, soft. It's, it's like just like the perfect environment for for sleeping, being unproductive. Bro, <laughs> I've seen so much people just <laughs> touch that couch and just going. Like, oh <laughs> my! I've never, <laughs> never seen you like this. Yeah. So yeah. Um what was I gonna say? You don't hear it, it's fine. You hear it, but I don't I hear it. Yeah, no. But yeah. Um it's like thumping on the, the psych wall. I was supposed to look up something on Twitter, you know. Or X. Whichever one. What's that? I was gonna look up like photography horror stories. Mm-hmm. Because you could search on Twitter, like, those words. Okay. Oh, um, I'm sure there's a... Shucks, I don't have X on this phone. Oh, I don't have Reddit on this one. I have X on this no, one. No, no, no. I have you X. have X? Yeah, I have X on this Okay, one. well. <sighs> it's fine. Photography. You don't have any interesting... Um. Sometimes I feel like I just, I just want to do stupidness just to have a cool story to tell. You know? If I look up X on the App Store, does it come up? Sure, oh, it does. It's formerly Twitter. All right. Because um, I hear these people with all these stories, and I'm like, bro, I I don't know if it's me, but I just feel like the thought process of what you went through and still did that is am not I my thought process. One? I don't what? Know how, am I supposed to put it all in one statement? What is that? On Reddit? Photography horror story. Yeah, I guess. I'll just search. Oh. I'd put that three separate words. I just don't know. It's some, no, but there was something I was watching, and I was like, that would have been a no cool results. thing to... No results? Yeah. For photography, horror, horror stories? Yeah. Okay, well then. Um, I feel like it might see that more on... Reddit? Yeah, I feel like... Okay, I think I found something. I know, but then you had to like. Um, Photography nightmares, I should probably just. Yeah, something like that. But I was. There was something I was watching. And um, I took a note of it somewhere, but I. I do remember it right now. Either way. Um, what did we talk about last time? We spoke about like being social and all that. Um. Uh, is it that you have one already? Okay, cliffhanger. We went probably should my glasses. Let's get a more professional inside of here. Okay, okay. So I'm I'm shooting a seascape on the coast of Malibu, California. Mm-hmm. It's a gorgeous coast with crazy cool cliffs that come all the way up to the water. There's about four between the cliff and the water. There are four feet, sorry, between the cliff and the water. It's really narrow. So I'm walking down the coast with all my gear to find the right spot. And I always shoot around sunset. I'm sitting there shooting in this area of the beach where there was a... I'm shooting... Oh wait, hold on. I'm sitting there shooting in this area of the beach that was a decent size. When I was fin- finished shooting, just as the sun sets, I'm packing up and I start walking back along the coast and I realize the water has risen above my above my way back i think that's a typo i think it's a typo i'm packing up myself and i started walking back along the coast and i realized the water has risen above my way back along the cliff yeah they made a typo okay and yeah i don't know what they meant by that anyways there's no more beach left and there's no way to get back i turn around and walk to the opposite way and there's nothing until I reach the other side of the cliff, which is also, which also had high water, so I was completely trapped. I noticed a homemade wooden ladder that was falling apart, but it led to a ramp with a metal door. The door was locked, and the door and fence was about 25 feet in the air and had, a metal, had metal spikes on the top, so you can't climb over without ripping yourself apart, but it was my only way. 
So I take my camera bag and my tripod and throw it over the door, and then I climb like a monkey over the fence. I make it down the other side, and I'm in some dude's back garden. It's not a house. It's a gorgeous fancy mansion on a cliff in Malibu. Who knows which celebrity owns it? I sneak around to the front to get out, and boom, there's an electric fence 17 feet tall, and it only opens electronically for cars. I'm standing in this guy's driveway. I'm not going to go and knock on his door, but the fence was barbed wire at the top too. So I started walking around the garden. I eventually find a tree with a branch that hangs over the fence. So I climb it, throw my gear down, then jump the 17 feet. It's not much of a nightmare. I thought I'd add more, but that's about it. That's it? Yeah. Oh, I was expecting so much more. Yeah. Um. Yeah. This person I, said. I don't know how people navigate Twitter, you know, like. Neither do I. This one says Itchy uh, Trigger Finger. That's the name of it. It's really short. After shooting a scene for a short film in a location with a very short time allowance, I went to set my w- white balance. I knew I had to click OK twice. However, my finger slipped and my menu landed right on format and I hit OK twice. We had to reshoot a scene. How does that, that even took happen? Three though? hours, but this time, it <laughs> <laughs> how do you hit it twice? I don't know. I guess it depends on the make uh, the camera. That is one of those. Okay, you, do you want a format? Okay. No, that's what I'm saying. How do you hit okay twice? Oh, without failure. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, like. Yeah. Like sometimes you can't even format it when I'm trying to format. <laughs> yeah. You literally no. hit oh you you went straight to format. Yeah. And then I was like, okay, okay. Okay. This one is called Ice Cold. Um Shooting a New Year's Eve wedding in Ont- Ontario, Canada, cottage country. There had been several feet of snow prior the week and then a freezing rain the night before. Mm-hmm. Thought we would be smart and take a shortcut from the preparation location to the ceremony venue. What could go wrong, right? The car couldn't get up the hill. I couldn't stare back down the hill without sliding either. I finally arrived 20 minutes late. Thank goodness they waited for us. And half the family members were stuck behind us. Mm-hmm. But from the ceremony... We went to a lake side for photos. I parked on hard park snow, I swear. However, the car melted some of the snow and sunk. The groom's father helped mm-hmm. the groom's father helped by laying down some chains and helping us push it out. Once the tires bit into the snow and chains, he fell face first into them. So I was late for the ceremony and managed to get the groom's father a nice shiny, a nice shiner, sorry, from the chains he fell on to. A nice shine? Shiner. Knock on the head. Oh, okay. Yeah. He had a bump on the beam. Okay. Um, I would have not picked up what a shiner was. Uh-huh. Um, oh, my gosh. Literally, when you're talking, I remember what it is I was going to say. And then it just vanished. And as soon as you stop. <laughs> um... What was it? It's coming back. Hold on. This was this was in the beginning. We were talking about technology. Mm-hmm. And oh, I'm okay with being old. Wait me that. I thought about it, and I was watching these um. These nuts. Um, no, I, it was a tweet. Somebody, t- somebody, somebody twatted, uh-huh. or zit. Somebody zitted. Whatever. The, I don't know what the, the the terminology is anymore. Uh, the lady was talking about like, I mean, I guess every boss is a little different. But she was, I guess, it's somebody in the states, I believe. Yeah. 
And she was saying that she works for a boss that doesn't even know how to like work an Excel spread an Excel spreadsheet or like how to do something and like make it into a PDF. Because mm-hmm. you can make an Excel spreadsheet into a PDF. Right? She's like, her boss doesn't even know how to do that. And I was thinking about it and I was like, okay, but that's not his job though. Yeah. <laughs> like I, I was really thinking about it. I was like, his job is to call Bill and say, you have any work for me this month? <laughs> you know? Yeah. That is his job is really to call up everybody and be like, hey, you know, you have money for me. Yeah. Yeah, organize yeah, yeah. yeah. You organize a new work. His job is not to make it into a PDF. Maybe in the early years he had to do the PDF and yeah, all that. But surpass that now. He's done enough. He sacrificed his life. Yeah. For this company to grow. Maybe not. Maybe he got the company handed to him from <laughs> somebody else. Yeah. What? No, nothing. Oh, I thought it was falling down or something. No. Um and I was like, this is I get you. I understand where you're coming from. But but also <laughs> that is not his place. Yeah, his place his is role, to right? no, at this moment. Get you money. Yeah. You know, because him making all these PDFs might just take up so much time and then now he can't pay you. <laughs> so that was it. Yeah. Somebody else told me that they were getting old and I was like, eh. No, okay. when, I, when I think about it, I don't think getting old is not that bad. You know, I think it's just you know you gotta reframe and restructure things and um, yeah, get a little bit of cash <laughs> and the things that you know you may do when you were younger, you may not do when you were when you're older, and everything is always changing so quickly. Um, you know it's hard to keep up. Yeah. It is really it is really hard to keep up with everything. Everybody wants you to be up to date with, with everything. literally everything. everything. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, dog. And when that one thing slips I, in I mind, have a life. Yeah. My car break down. Yeah. I break my leg. I do this. I do that. And my house just get lit on fire. And, and I must be updated in the news. Yeah. And I must be politically correct with everything. And I must be Oh, you don't know where my hour is, but you live in you live in Trinidad. I'm like, dog, I cannot keep know track of everything, <laughs> every yeah. single thing. Yeah, no, I, I need to breathe. Where's that? <laughs> I mean, it's probably a terrible reference, but where's he? Is it R. Kelly? He just need a chance or something like that. Where's the interview? And he's no, I'm he's fighting like, for my life. <laughs> I'm fighting for my life, bro. <laughs> I'm like, dog, I just I'm tired need this, man. I, I just I'm, need to breathe. Yeah, yeah. I cannot know everything. No, I agree. I agree. And I feel like... people want you to know everything. And I'm like, this is not... Yeah, no, I can't... This ain't fun. I can agree that I feel as though, you know, I can't keep track of it all. And then some things do slip me. Oh, you don't know what's so and so? Yeah. And and just here, like, give me a break. I just just honestly can't. And I have not been fighting. I have to try to keep track of a lot of things now. Because I'm just like... Everyone, under, I feel like a lot of people understand that I'm super busy and I have a million and one things to do. So, I'm like, if it can't fall into place, well, for, or you go figure out your place, wherever you are, man. I'm not fighting anything. And talking about uh, slipping mine, another photography horror story. <clears throat> oh. That's a good transition there, boy. Check it, check it, check it, check it. Peep, peep, peep the game. Okay. Travel to Los Angeles from an assignment in which I had to photograph an artist for an editorial. Bring everything I can think that I may need, camera, lenses, tripod, flash, batteries, etc. Leave for Los Angeles like a boss and excited for my first assignment as a staff photographer. Two hours later, I'm there, standing in the artist's studio, preparing for my photo shoot. The artist's time is very limited and we only have an hour to work together. Everything is ready. Artist set up for photos. Take the first snapshot. Memory full. No memory card. Oh. I mean, if you're in the States, I mean, how hard is it to get a card, though? But remember, the artist's time is limited. Oh, okay. Well, then, yeah. That. How would you deal with <laughs> a situation? <laughs> Honestly, how would you deal with a situation like that? <laughs> I think, yeah. Travel to a different country. I'll be honest, I'm going to lie. 
whatever in happens in the situation, I'm lying about it. Um hmm. I was gonna say maybe say my card got corrupted. Mm-hmm. Or um Actually, you shouldn't lie, you know? But I think maybe if you have the funds, try to meet them where they're at. Like, you know, like when you do get back the stuff. Yeah. Okay, you're going to be in Atlanta in two weeks or whatever. Mm-hmm. Tomorrow, I can maybe try and meet you there and then kind of yeah. recoup that. Because I feel like you would have paid me already. Yeah. Yes, my plans was not to go to Atlanta. But you paid but me for the I, service. I I, to, yeah, you know. and I didn't really make it happen. Or you get them yeah. a refund and, you know, they just never yeah, yeah. use you again. You, and you can't really expect to work with everybody, yeah? Mm-hmm. Um, everybody has their own lane and... Yeah. Um, what was I going to say? I think if you have a bad experience with one person, you tend to think that... This is the end of it, you know. In it's terms like of the artist, you know, the, you think the artist is going to like tell everybody and their oh, granny, and, like, and they're like, done. "Yep, my career is over." Mm-hmm. And realistically, it's like, eh, give it a month, yeah. you'll be fine. <laughs> like, yeah, they might tell one person, be like, "Eh, this can't happen on the shoot," but you, th- I think there might be ways to play it off. I mean, it's for editorial. Um, I don't know how that is weak. Or if it's for editorial, then mm-hmm. yeah, you definitely had to come back a different day. Yeah, because it said, uh, um, um, I don't know. I just feel like in those situations, I feel like it's not hard to get a, uh, yeah. a SD card from somewhere though. Uh, for an assignment in which Especially I had to photograph LA, like, an artist for editorial. How far in LA, like, are you away from people? Like, you could probably just make a call and be like, well, they travel there, so yeah. No, but I mean, like, hmm. I know. I feel like there's always some kind of photo, something Yeah, no, it, It's like, probably like a Target or Walmart right around the corner yeah. to just buy a cheap sticker. Yeah, it don't need to be great. It could take it just need to one hold picture, picture. It just every need to hold the picture. 30 seconds. It just needs to hold the picture. <laughs> the picture. <laughs> so I, I feel like there might be a way to work around it. Yeah. Um, but I would go through that first. I would try my best to not lie. Not to be like, wait, but here it's not. <laughs> No card. <laughs> <laughs> so check here tomorrow or um, I don't know. Like in 10 minutes, let me just run around yeah, the corner and yeah, see yeah. at least if I can find a store. Yeah. Because even if you have like a two hour block or maybe an hour, an hour block. Is right? there a way to. Even if you spend 40 minutes getting any card and you have that yeah. 20 minutes to shoot, just start at least pull that trigger. It's, it's like, here's what. It will happen. Target is 20 minutes away. Yeah. 20 to go, 20, 20 to, to come go. back, what? 20 to shoot. I don't need to take long. We just yeah. need to get we just need five to get pictures. Up. Yeah, five pictures. One really good one out of the five, and the other four will just kind of fill up Yeah, the rest of it. Mm-hmm. Other than that, I, I, mm-hmm. I think, yeah, yeah. This other person says, I spent ages preparing my gear for a once-in-a-while eclipse the night before. So I go down on that series. If you miss the eclipse, it's okay. Yeah. I guess I don't care. I don't care about the moon and yeah. Well, depends on what type of photography. And yeah. the I mean, if this is like, I mean, celestial events are like, yeah. you gotta wait until the next fifty years till this thing comes back. I feel like <laughs> every two years, there's always a new event that hasn't happened since fifty years ago. <clears throat> I don't know if it's just me, but I feel, if I'm being honest, I've been on this earth for not even twenty-five years. Mm. And the amount of, hey, the solar eclipse is happening, which hasn't happened since 1967. I'm like, <laughs> okay. So the first one, that one happened. And then, because I remember there was <laughs> one in school. Like, I was in school, and we all literally, like, made the things to see them. Yeah. Um, My eyes were burning watching this, and I was like, dog, I, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I can, I don't know if I can make it up. Um, uh, so there was that. But I remember, like, as I got older, there was more and more of those events. And I'm like, yeah. this seems to be a normal occurrence. It's just wherever you are on the map, on the globe. Sorry. I think. You know, 
it may have happened you since may have... 1973 or whatever but i, I think feel like you... every other year yeah there's some kind of eclipse something or like it, it, not that extent it's like it's weird because yes but no i don't know uh because like the positioning is yes it's an like eclipse but is the type of eclipse it is yeah, that makes sense so the person said they prepared the night before so they could get some extra sleep, packed their bags, mm-hmm. jumped in the car, drove two hours to the spot, opened their bag. Guess what? No camera? No. Or the battery's dead? No lenses. Oh. Their roommates took their lenses. Oh, well, then that... <laughs> I don't know about that one. You had to tell me, hey, I take any lenses. That yeah. is like... Yeah. You can really prepare so much for things. My roommate had decided to borrow them. Yeah, you need to tell me that... Um, Hey, I could do X, Y, and Z. I know it's your property, you know. Yeah. I was trying to find... Um... That's a scary place now, you know. Oh, yeah, it is. I was scrolling, and I saw something. I was like, all right, that's it for the night. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> uh-uh. Yeah, I was like... Oh. No, like, I'm very wary. I see that so up in much Bitcoin stuff now, though. Yes, no, like... I'm like, dog, I am not trying to... I'm not as trying to ads, invest. as you um, recommended or suggested ads, and I'm just here like, dog, what is this? I, uh, no, no, no. Elon be having them bots moving crazy. Yeah, I thought he was getting rid of them. Um, How's that working out? Who's getting rid of what? I thought he said he was dealing with the 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 bots and um, uh, all of that stuff. I doubt. Yeah, he hasn't really been doing it. Um. I really want to get some people on the podcast. And you know what I don't really get? You know how, like, some restaurants put the food in, like, those bowls and then turn the bowls upside down and now your rice rice inside of a dome shape? Mm -hmm. I don't like that. That's my hot take. I hate that. Why are you putting my rice in It's supposed to look good. It's supposed to look clean. It's rice. No, 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 but... No, listen... Stop it. I understand what you're saying. No. Stop it. But some people care about how the thing looks. It yeah. makes it taste better. Give me a break. <laughs> it, the looks of the food <laughs> right, make it taste be better. In a cube or a dome shape. Okay? Yeah, right. right. We're going to go Kaizen uh-huh. on that day. And I'm going to tell them, take the sushi and squish it up in your hand <laughs> and slap it on the plate. <laughs> No, you see, and that's see a <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say no, no, no. You don't, you don't care how it looked. You, that, you care. There's a difference. No, no, no. I'm that going to tell them. Take some to sushi and squish it up in your hand. No, because it have rice my, in it. I don't want to see my fried rice in a. In a, in a it have rice on the sushi. So yes. I'm going to tell them squish it up in no. their hand and you see, slap it on the plate. There's a difference. And <laughs> he's a, going to eat it. There's a difference because it is a roll. Okay, it is called a roll. It's My rice. portion of rice is not supposed to be in a dome. No, it's like, it's like, I mean, you're the oldest sibling, so I don't think you really understand as much. But um, no, it's just about having it. It's like bathing, you know, it's just taking care of yourself. Just being presentable. No, it, is <laughs> it is about being presentable, hmm. right? And that is all it is, the presentation Set the standard. That's why some people go Kaizen for sushi and some people go, you know, exactly. <laughs> you know. Do I? Nah, you don't know. Exactly. Um, no, but that's why there's five star restaurants and then there's one stars, yeah, you know, no, it, and then the thing is like, there's three and four. And there's, that's why there's a level step because some people care about how the rice looks. Yeah, but guess what? I feel like if you have to be doing all this extra stuff to something like rice, food might not be that good because you have to try to distract me. <laughs> no. You, know you need I mean? to go buy a horrible barber one day. Mm. 
and then you'll this understand. Why I go to places that you, no, because you know. if if the man apparently cares too much about how you look, he's trying to distract you with something. No, that's what you just said. No, that's what you just said. I'm just saying that is what you just said. That there's levels to food. Exactly, but which I'm is also, why you put the rice saying, in the bowl. Eh? I'm not saying to and give whack it the shape. I'm not saying to whack everything and I play it and like make it look crazy. I'm just saying when you see a sushi come out. <laughs> Looking like somebody manhandle it, just know <laughs> you look for that. That being said, I have a point. Yeah. For the younger siblings out there, mm-hmm. I have an issue. What is your issue? It's really not about the younger siblings. I went by Michael a day. Oh, okay. Right? He said, You want hot dogs? <laughs> I said, Bye. I can eat. And my mom went down, but I'm hot dog. I said, All right, talk to me. Right? Slap my hot dog and in your bread, just bear there. <laughs> I see my boy Sata. Fry, I see frying pan come out. I see boy with na. What my what is treatment for me? Nope. Whacked my face. I see boy with I see frying pan come out. Things that are cook. I see he's had a crunch of chips. I oh see, yeah, that's how they use. I the see sauce I never see before in the fridge. I see. I, I never, I know come from that fridge. I was in there. Where you pull all the sauce from? I say, but you giving yourself the works. Mm-hmm. And I just get the hot dog. It's normal. <laughs> I, 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 mean, I, I don't know. I, that hurt me there. That was it. That's for my younger siblings. Um, you know, I just feel like you always have an older sibling that just takes that extra bit of care with their food. Mm-hmm. And then you just there like, dog, I just want something in my belly. And I am hungry. Yeah. But they're like, no, no, no. I'm going to make it look good so I can appreciate this. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was my story. Um, that's it. I'm really hungry, though, if I'm being honest. Mm-hmm. I okay. ate this morning mm-hmm. some doubles. Okay. You know, um, turned out on Tobago's national breakfast. Mm-hmm. It may not be Tobago. I'm not sure. Uh, there's doubles in Tobago, but it's not like. I it. know there's doubles in Tobago, but it's I don't know if they like would it. consider it their like their their breakfast, you know. Oh no, not really. No. But um, I'm hungry. Yeah, that's fine. That's me. I really I'm struggling to find this. What you were looking for? Yes, which is why I've been on my phone and I'm like, I just wanted to appear from somebody. I'll give you another horror story in the meantime. Um, I saw this girl on Twitter say, mm-hmm. <laughs> what is she, she said, nah. Oh my gosh, what is her name? She said, nah, I wish I was just ugly or something like that. And I was like, I don't know. I don't know. Is that is that really what you want? What's that? She said she want, she want to just be ugly. I feel like I need context. I think people want things that they don't really know. Know what they really get themselves into. Yeah. 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 It's only once they reach. I don't know how to. It's only once they reach, they want to backpedal. Yeah. Hello? Nah, that's just probably the oh, air. Or the, um. And the door. But, um. Something like some strange air boy. Just joking. Um. What was this thing? I feel like people want to see the other side. Mm-hmm. Sometimes knowing full well that the other side is not what they want. It's not green up. Yeah. Sometimes the other side is is mm. <laughs> is not as green. Um, I mean, there's there's videos, there's stories of, um. I think the only one that I could really think about is people that like lose weight. Like they go from like, <laughs> no, okay. why, why are you laughing no. for? No, it's just the way how you was like, people that kind of lose weight. No, because yeah. I feel like I have to be politically correct about okay. things. This is why okay, I say okay. I cannot do everything. <laughs> um, okay. Speak people truth, watch man. you differently when you lose weight. Yeah. And it's like, everybody wants to think that, you know, they don't. But they do. You get treated differently mm-hmm. when you're bigger and you're unhealthy. I wouldn't say it. Okay. You know what? <laughs> Fine. 
<laughs> no, but I'm I'm talking about myself. I was okay. a little bigger and yeah. I was unhealthy. I was literally struggling to get up some stairs. Yeah. I'm not talking about like I don't have a person in my head other than myself. <laughs> yeah. You know? Okay. Um I'm not saying I'm the most attractive person now. I'm just saying. Yeah. I feel like the I girl is different. hard to look at. Yeah. <laughs> you know, ties it. Um but yeah, I I I, I think that um you know everybody watching like who's you like I, I, I just trying to be a normal person mm-hmm. you know but there's also these stories of like people just watch you differently um they watch you like like you're not really a person and then you lose weight you get a little shape and you get your muscles mm-hmm. and then you're like ooh Chabari nice and you're looking, looking a little nice, yeah. you know. All of a sudden, you're getting compliments of, "You're looking this outfit, it, it fits it in your nice one." Yeah, nice one. You're like, yeah. "Bro, I've been wearing this for four years. What are you talking about? This is the same. I've been recycling fits." Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean by that? <laughs> I'm looking good now. What was what was going on before? Mm-hmm. And you just you're like, "Yeah, what to do? What to do?" Mm. So um, that was it. That, I I I don't know. I, um, that was my little take on the girl saying she'd rather be ugly. I mean, I feel like she was joking, but also. Yeah, but do you think that it's just coming from a place of being constantly spoken to in a particular way because of how she looks, and then it's like for sure, dog. You know, if I was ugly. Nobody would be talking to him, but then... Yeah, yeah, for sure. You know, the double-edged sword where... You really want that little attention, though. Yeah. <laughs> if I be in completely honest. Are you, what are you like saying? What do you mean by that? Are you saying, like, you know you want people to click your profile picture to, to I, look at I, you? I personally mm-hmm. want people to look at me and be like, you know, you look cute. I ain't saying you had a chance after me, you know. Yeah. I, I go in and say, no, I have a council. There's a board of directors. Yeah. Um. That consists of one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's only one director. But um, what was this point? I was thinking <laughs> this is probably bad. But um, <laughs> I <laughs> sometimes want the option to tell somebody no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's like you never invite me to the party, but I wasn't going, but. You ain't give me the opportunity to say no. <laughs> yeah, I, I never get the opportunity to say no. I'm like, Jabari, you're real nice. No, do not speak to me. I do not know you from a place. And then it's like, ah, yes, the power to say no. <laughs> yes, I says. Yeah, I that was, That's really about it. But, um, yeah, that's, that's my struggle. Um. <laughs> 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 now, I said my friends that sometimes they just be like, wow, you never invite me. It's like, Jabari, you even coming? I was like, no, but you didn't give me the opportunity to tell yeah, you that. Nah, yeah, I can't yeah. come. I, 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 I can't come because I'm going to be doing nothing, but you know, you still yeah. didn't give me the opportunity. You have to think, think about me now. Like, yeah. I still like to go, to, like, I like to think about being at these things. Yeah, no, I, I would I don't like want to go to the things. Yeah. But I want to think about I'm being like, at these things. Should I? I said, you know, I go where? Where I'm a close. Nah, not that. <laughs> yeah, I get that. I understand. But no, nah, but I I do I say it as a joke. I don't actually think it's serious. Um, yeah, that's that's my thing. But I I do get where you're coming from. Where certain things that you change, you get a different reaction from people. Yeah, and it's something you can't deny. So humans just weird like that. Yeah, they must comment. They they had a comment. It's also uh, yeah. Yes, they just had a the man, these are is Wait, was why? But I can ask Lanza about any flaw, you know. Why? Why the first thing you telling me is, "Hey, Shabari, you gain weight." Yeah, so true. your man still leave you shut up. Yeah, I you Jesus don't hear you me are. talking about your trauma. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. We, ha- I haven't seen you in four years. Your first thing is, "What are you looking at, big there, boy?" I was like, <laughs> <"Okay."> <laughs> um, good evening. <laughs> how How are you? Yeah, no, as I was like coming out of COVID, Auntie was like, 
Jamari, come on, talk over. Everybody get big and you get smaller. I was like, I know you're real blunt, but no, no, only to relax. Dry, dry. Mm. Yeah, yeah, that's why when anybody no, asks anything, I would tell them nothing. You're gonna start the engine warm it up, you know how nah, things, nah. how you going, you know. You know, <laughs> at least give me give me the benefit of the doubt. Like you were sick, I find you looking all slim. Yeah, nice. I'm gonna take that. <laughs> you just hit me straight, boom, bombs. I'm like, dog. I, mm. Good morning. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Granted, I wasn't even eating properly during COVID. It's just one of those things where man. If it's nothing to eat, I'm not going to yeah. bother. Because can't go to the grocery. Yeah. Womp womp. What you could do. Yeah. You know? Also, some people's perception is, is different. Yeah, that's true. Because um, what was it, boy? Something happened. And somebody was like, you working out? I said, no, 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 no. And then literally, like two days after, somebody was like, mm, you're getting kind of big, you know? <laughs> but like, like in a bad way. And I was like, but I'm not getting... I was like, it's been two days. I don't understand. What is going on? I can't <laughs> figure out who lied to me. Because <laughs> two days ago, I was feeling good. I was ready to conquer the world. Now you tell me this, and I... I, I like don't know if this basically was just being sarcastic or if yeah. you just being rude. Hmm? Yeah. No, I, I don't know who to believe. <laughs> you know? Wait, was, and Trisha asked me for a hug. I give out. She said, you're probably getting real strong. Oh, yeah. I, I said, remember you nah, talking about it. Say you're working out. I said, nah, nah, nah. I don't, I don't do them thing. I don't, do, I don't know what that is. And I'm going to tell you, skin looking kind of loose there. But <laughs> what the fuck going on here, boy? It's like, but, but my auntie tell me. <laughs> but, 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 but my mommy said. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> yeah. So you come in class Thursday. Yeah. Sorry, not Thursday, Wednesday. Oh, I thought it was on Thursday. Thursday is the one where people hit you. I guess I can make one. The medicine. Oh, no. I'm not looking for no bruises. I could. I mean, listen. Protect your face at all times. To punch a bag? No, if you come in Thursday. No, I don't come in Thursday. And I need to buy a mouth guard, but that's only like $40. It's not that expensive. For, for Wednesday? No, for Thursday. I'm not come coming in. on Thursday. Yeah, the buy a mouth guard. Oh, yeah, no, we don't do it on no, that. No, no. But um, Wednesday is fine. Yeah. Um, yeah, you hit a bag. Um, yeah, I need nothing. Outfits. Just look at a couple of videos of how to throw a punch. That's about it. Like, they're not gonna teach me. Um, I don't know. You know, he should. He should recognize that you know he hasn't seen you before, and then yeah, and uh, yeah. I I have spaghetti arms and legs, and I weigh. I don't think that has to do with anything. And either. I weigh two pounds, nothing. I have no weight behind my punches. That is really it. Yeah. But also, I think good technique and uh, somebody that is not expecting it <laughs> could go a long way. Does that make sense? Yeah. It's like... It's one of those, oh, he got he could, he could hit hard, boy. Eh? No, it's not even... I don't know if the, the, the strength of it is really the, the matter. Oh, yeah, please, it, man. It have some fellas that are like, some of them slim. But they, but they go rest on you. Of, because <laughs> of their form, if you get hit, you're like, dog, I want to end my life. <laughs> and then some people are just like, they're strong, but they don't have the technique. So it's kind of like, you know when you get hit, you know it's just because of their strength. Yeah. And you know just body. Get, you just know body. If they get the technique, then GGs. you'll want to die. But um, but no, I mean like, there's ways to fake people and all that kind of stuff. So it's like, mm-hmm. you get them to do one thing and then you react to that. And then they're not really expecting you to react. Yeah. So you just kind of like get that. Where's the board at with, with it? I know the board was not. Um, no, no, no. They're, they're still not, they're not on not board. All. Okay. But I was just asking if you were if you were doing it Thursday, I would have done it Thursday. No, no. How come? Um, I'll come on, th- on Wednesday, not Thursday. I, I bruise easily. I yeah. don't need. Violence is not really something that. Um, no, I'm very passive. Yeah. But I think it's it's really like I I just do whatever I have to do and I don't think about anything else. Yeah. And then my hour passes and I'm like, alright, cool, time to go home. Mm-hmm. And then that's about it. You say six thirty. Six thirty to seven thirty. Oh, which are normally late, boy. No, yeah. we the next day. Whatever. So we move. Yeah, unless you don't go four o'clock in the morning. No, no, I come from far. Yeah. See. Um, yeah. Let's see how that goes. That 
that's a trying out a new sport. Um, I'm trying out a new sport. And there's there's everything there for you. So you just kind of have to show up, put your clothes, mm-hmm. and die about it. Wait. I don't know if I like how this is. You have anything Oop. else to add? Um. Hold on, what did I do here? Oh, it's half five already. Okay, we have almost 20,000 bars. Um, I don't think I put it in the podcast at the or the mic mm-hmm. audio. Thing. I don't know what that means. It's just the time was different. Like, it would read, uh, it would read it as like, uh, if you're making like a musical track. Oh, yeah. So, you yeah, like 16. Bar, yeah, okay. But it's at 20,000 bars now, so. Um, yeah, does that? Uh, guess. Yeah, we need to organize. Yeah, we need to work on that. Um, did you post this week? No. Okay. Because I think I prefer to keep it like this. I don't know if I like the one angle thing anymore. Okay. Um, just to keep the 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 value high. Even though I was watching those guys, and they just have one angle. And they just crop into that one angle. Yeah, they punch into whoever's talking. Yeah. So that is also an option, but I prefer the quality of the video to be a little better with the having the, the two off cameras. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, that's okay. But yeah, I was just thinking, I've just been thinking about like how to make it better. <laughs> so if you all have suggestions. Yeah. You could let us know. What would you like to see in a podcast? Who would you like to see? Um, don't call any big names in order. Go and say double M as yet. Maybe one day. Or oh, um, MT. Who's that? Hello. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, okay. I, I figured it out. Yeah. I know what it is. Um, Pondam, you know? Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stocks so going up. So, you know? Hmm. Yeah. That might, I mean... Nothing is impossible. I don't think it's impossible. Just you know, the stock going up. Yeah. So we're just navigating that. We're working on it. For sure, we'll get a guest. We really are trying to do like weekly uploads. If we could do a new guest every week, that would be great. Mm-hmm. It may be hard at times because you know somebody might cancel. Yeah. A little day before or something, or even if we just like have a couple days of just like. Or like one full day. We're just recording a bunch of stuff. People come and pass through. Um, I hear that. Yeah, um, no. I, I, I um, unscrew it and then I realize it's not tightening back. <laughs> oh. Okay, there you go. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Just working on that. Yeah. Working on the schedules and then researching people to have good questions because <laughs> I don't want to feel dumb when I'm asking them yeah. a question. <laughs> Um, it makes for awkward conversation. I sent you that voice note of when we spoke to we spoke to some people a while ago, and then they kind of said like you know the questions felt like they were very surface level. Yeah, I think so. Probably. Yeah, I don't really want that to happen again. So um, you know. Oh yeah, I remember it. Yeah. Yeah. So. That's about it. That's where my head is at. Um, photos, podcast. Uh, I hope it was okay to see this computer here. I mean, there's not really a way to hide it, if I'm being completely honest, <laughs> because of that. And that's why, like, everything is there. Um, but, yeah. I think that's it. I don't know if you have any. I don't got anything else. Okay. So... That's really also all like been on my mind. It's just the podcast. Like, how do I make it better? So I started to watch those people. Yeah. Um, so I'm gonna go through the little twelve episodes and see like, what's what? Oh yeah, like what do they ask people? But I think from at least the first one that I saw with Penny, he's just he talks for a living. Yeah. Like, I know. so you, you ask him a question, you throw him something small, and he'll run with yeah, it. Yeah, he will run with it. Yeah. So other than that, um. I mean, I would have loved to have him on the podcast, but I, I'm thinking like also like yes, he could come on, obviously, but it's a little more tricky because 
he done gave a whole life story there for two hours. Yeah. So then to repeat. Yeah, it's like you gotta come extra good now, which is good for us. You know, because we can get like extra info that they didn't get. Yeah, like, yeah. You know, yeah, we know where th- what they may not have asked. Yeah, um, yeah. So kind of pinpoint. No, you could go a little deeper. Yeah. It's like, oh, we saw you on this podcast. Yeah. What do you mean by that? Which what, what you mean by that? <laughs> yeah. So just being a better podcast and just pushing uh the show. Yeah. I think we need to start doing shorts though. Cause I'll be seeing the interaction on the YouTube shorts be going crazy. Okay. Because, like, I have a, a guy I went to school with. I know he used to post, like, small YouTube videos back in secondary school. And they get, like, 40, 50 views. Mm-hmm. And then I saw him, saw him these days, like, at YouTube um, events and stuff. And I said, like... Yeah. I know you used to make your small YouTube videos, but I ain't seen that I subscribed to you because, you know, school, you know, yeah. daddy dog. Mm. Oh, you just pumping out shorts and that's it? But he's just pumping out shorts and buddy have 100,000. Oh. Hmm. <clears throat> I mean, it's not hard to make them. Yeah, it's just um, a cut it up. Yeah. Um. That's, that's, I mean, that's, that's really the general trajectory that we're trying to go in. For the podcast, at least, I feel like they should have been higher, but I yeah, but he's low. approaching 200k. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna just leave it here. Um, yeah, that's the trajectory that we're trying to go in for the podcast, at least, just trying to up the value mm-hmm. of the content. Yeah. Um, you know, so make sure to watch. Sorry, why, why would I say that here? And it's like super simple. Like all he does, green screen, and then text. Text. Okay. Super simple. Yeah, I mean we could, we'll get into the videos and we can do the shorts. It's like his last, up. like his last proper YouTube video was six years ago. Mm-hmm. And everything and has just been shorts. Everything has just been shorts. All right. Well. Outside of that, it's like a hundred k subscribers and. All right. Well. We work on it. We'll be better. Yeah. So I guess y'all could reference this video um, in December if we followed through on our promises, I guess, that we'll make this better production. We'll have guests on here, one, and then we'll increase, like, the... I don't know how to say this nicely, but the the prominency of the guest you know like as we go along i think it's just one though like we have in guests that like you know have the frequency of the guests yeah but we'll get some cool stories for y'all yeah i think that's really what it's about um so if we don't have somebody on next week i will do the next episode with no shoes on just bare feet. Okay, if we don't have our next guest on, what what is what is the? I, if you want to do the show bare bare feet, no guess fault. No, but we're not gonna tell the guest anything. Okay, no problem. Well, the, the next person. Okay. So if we don't have one next week, the next guest. The will next just guest is I'm just gonna be bare feet. Okay. No problem. That's it. All right. Cool. Like That's that. gonna be real awkward. <laughs> yeah. Especially like if we get like somebody <laughs> like someone relatively high profile or yeah. high profile. I don't know. I guess high profile, but like um more like businessy. Mm. Like you know, like where like you dress up like suit and all Important. that. Important. Kind of and yeah. then I just they're like no shoes. <laughs> I'm trying to be grounded. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, I can say that. 